Okay. So we will start with our posture. You can sit either cross legged, half lotus, full lotus. You can be sitting on the chair. You can even be walking for this meditation. But whatever your posture is, you can even be lying down. But whatever the posture is, just make sure your back is straight. Your spine is also relaxed. Muscles around the spine are relaxed. So that there's flow of wind energy in the body. So you can spend a few moments making sure your back is relaxed but straight, not too hunched, not too uptight either. Somewhere in the middle. You can keep your eyes partially open, fully closed, fully open depending on how you're feeling. If you feel too dull, you can keep them open so that there's light coming into your eyes. If you feel too excited all over the place, then you can keep them closed. It's often recommended that you keep your eyes slightly open to enter some light. But if you've been meditating for a long time with closed eyes, just let them be closed. It's okay. Your hands can be resting on the knees or can be on your lap, your right one capped on your left one, thumbs touching. And you can try and relax your body with a vigilant mind, with awareness. We'll do a gentle scan. We'll start from our spine itself because that's where we were. We were. You can start with your lower back. Try and see if there any tension. See if you can relax this tension if there is. So your lower back soft and relaxed. Your upper back, soft and relaxed. Try and relax all the muscles in this area, in this region. Back of the neck, soft and relaxed. Cheekbones. All the muscles around this area. Your eyes and eyebrows. Forehead. Top of the head. And all of your face. Relax it fully and gently. Your shoulders.
your arm, elbows. Forehand. Wrists. Your palm. Thumbs of both your hands. Every single finger. Your chest. Tummy. And see if you can relax the organs inside this region. All the organs. Let them be, let them drop. Your pelvis region. buttocks soft and relaxed with the vision in mind you can relax your thighs your knees and muscles around the knees All the muscles between your knees and ankles. Ankles. Both the feet. Soft and relax. And all your toes. In this way, you've relaxed both your legs fully. So you can stay with your body now for some time, for a few moments. Your attention somewhere with your body, somewhere here. You can also relax your mind if there are any tension, agitation, any thoughts. You can let all of them go. 
because you are training your mind right now. I'm sure they'll come back. So with the next out breath, you can let all of these thoughts, agitation, tension, anger go if there is anything there. Now let's set the motivation for the practice in your own thoughts, in your own head, in your own words. Just bring to mind why you are sitting here today. What, what brings you here, here today? And see if you can bring an altruistic motivation to your mind. How can you help other people through your practice? How other people are going to get benefited through this practice. How your peace of mind, how your relaxed mind, aware mind help will help people around you. Your colleague, your family, your students. And once you set the motivation, just gently bring the awareness to your breath, either at your tummy, where you can feel the expansion and the fall of tummy, or to the entrance of your nostrils, where you can feel the sensation of breath as you breathe in and out. So you can choose either of these focal points. Make sure throughout the meditation you stay with one focal point and you keep bringing yourself back to this point of focus. If you have any other focal point, you can go with that as well. So we'll start in this way now.
If you have lost yourself, bring yourself back to your breath. If you feel too dull, refresh your posture, refresh your body and come back to the practice.
Okay. We will end our practice with a dedication prayer by Shanti Deva. May all beings everywhere, plagued by suffering of body and mind, obtain an ocean of happiness and joy by virtues of my merits. May no living creature suffer, commit evil, or ever fall ill. May no one be afraid or be little. May the mind be down by depression. With the blind see forms and the deaf hear sounds. May those whose bodies are worn with toil be restored on finding repose. May the naked find clothing, the hungry find food. May the thirsty find water in delicious drinks. May the poor find wealth, those weak with sorrow find joy. May the hopeless find hope, constant happiness and prosperity. May there be timely rains and bountiful harvests. May all the medicines be effective and wholesome prayers bear fruit. May all who are sick and ill quickly be freed from all their ailments. Whatever diseases there are in the world, may they never occur again. May the frightened cease to be afraid and those bound be freed. May the powerless find power and people think of benefiting each other. For as long as space remains, for as long as ancient beings remain, until then may I too remain to dispel the miseries of the world. Thank you everyone. Thank you for joining. I hope this was helpful. I hope to see you some of you tomorrow. Goodbye. Have a nice day.